Welcome back to the channel. This is your international midwife. Today on the channel, we are going to discuss a client's husband's question. Yes, our pregnant woman husband posed a question to us that due to pregnancy, his wife is denying him of sex. His question reads, Hello, international midwife. My wife is five months pregnant and has denied me of sex since. I want to know the following, please. Can we have sex? If yes, when? If no, why? Are there any specific sex positions used in pregnancy? Are there benefits of sex in pregnancy? Because a friend told me when her his wife, her wife, yeah, her wife labor started, the midwife encouraged them to go home and have sex. When they returned to the hospital, baby came out shot. And that brings us to today's discussion, sex in pregnancy. My name is Saada Sadiq. You can call me Miss Sa, your international midwife. I'm a senior midwifery officer from Kolebu Teaching Hospital. I come with you with all health topics and the pregnant woman passport. But today we are going to discuss sex in pregnancy. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, kindly subscribe to the channel and share the video to all friends hit the bell button so you get notified whenever i upload a video and if you're already here i love you so much and thank you for always being there for me to our client question if he can have sex with a wife it's a yes and no okay so if if a no meaning that the wife could possibly have certain complications in pregnancy and it has been medically advised that she does not have sex in pregnancy so some of the conditions could be hematoma placenta previa cervical insufficiency history of preterm birth or preterm labor and then if the client is also losing lyco or leaking amniotic fluid then she is restricted from having sex these are usually guided by the medical profession so that the client abides through this um, conditions of not having sex and then the client is monitored closely mostly we encourage the couple to come to clinic together so that we could share your your woman's consent to you so that it helps for the two of you to have a good couple life. It is also a yes if the woman has normal pregnancy and is comfortable with the sex activity. Yes, so if she is comfortable with it or if she's having hormonal imbalance, you guys could discuss as to when and where to have sex. During pregnancy, the woman goes through a whole lot of hormonal changes and physical changes and some don't want to expose their nakedness to their partner. So in this case, the two of you need to cooperate and then do that together. To the next question, are there specific sex positions during pregnancy? There are no specific sex positions during pregnancy. Whatever position you are comfortable with as a couple, you go for it. So maybe due to the bump, you're scared to lie on your wife or your wife is scared for you to do the missionary style. So you can adopt other ones like she could lie on her side mm -hmm. and then you'll be, you also lie on your side and then you'll be at the back or you face each other depending if the two of you are comfortable with that position. Also, she could um, hold something or be on her knees or I mean, she can hold something and then you 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 penetrate from behind so that is also another position for you and if you're comfortable your wife can sit on you and that could give you a good sexual activity without any trouble the last question of the client asking if there's any benefit of sex in pregnancy yes there are so many benefits 
of sex during pregnancy. During orgasm, the woman feels a more relief and then relaxed. So if she is going through um, a bit of moment of discomfort and she wants you to make love to her, you can do it. And then the, org the orgasm can make her feel very good. So the reason why the midwife encourage your friend and the wife to go home and have sex is that during sex there is breast stimulation, there is orgasm from the woman and then there is ejaculation of semen from the, from the male. So in that case, the semen contains prostaglandins and these three all mixed together in their activity could prepare the uterus and stimulate contractions in the latter part of pregnancy so in the third trimester sometimes some women have few contractions which are quite uncomfortable called the Braxton Hiss contractions and these contractions can prepare the uterus for labor so during labor when some women have that at their own comfort is able to stimulate and help with the contraction and dilatation of the cervix before i continue if you haven't subscribed to my channel kindly subscribe to the channel and hit the bell button below so you get notified every time you come around and if you haven't joined any of my facebook group kindly do it is search for me my name is saada sadik your international midwife wrapping up on the topic of sex during pregnancy so i want to i want to alleviate any fear from every pregnant woman that your baby could be hurt during sex no if you're having a normal pregnancy your baby will not be hurt the uterus that is our womb have very firm and strong muscles that hold babies together and nothing can happen to these babies the amniotic fluid the water in which the baby lies do you know that it serves as a cushion and a shock absorber uh, yeah, that is what it does. So during the sex activity or the vibration and rigorous moment, the baby doesn't feel anything and doesn't know what mommy and daddy are doing. So it is safe to have sex in pregnancy. Then on the other side, to protect our baby rather, this is what we should do. If you are in a polygamous relationship or marriage, kindly advise your partner to use condom. Yeah, because in case he has contacted any STI from the other partner or from any of your rivals, you could get to you and your baby and you're going to spoil the life of your baby. I mean, if it's not detected, you don't know what is going to happen. So please, let's try and avoid that. And also, if you, the woman, if you are going to have sex with a new partner other than your partner, I mean, things do happen kindly use a condom and protect your baby thank you so much for staying with you with me and i hope to see you next time on the channel continue with a pregnant woman passport but if you do have questions like this client kindly comment below kindly send your your um questions to me and you have any contribution as a health professional kindly share under the comment and let's all learn from it thank you bye bye this is missa your international midwife.